Here I am signed in in Google Classroom as a student. But before I even open this class, I want to make one point about work in Classroom. Here's a document that I accessed in Google Classroom. And you'll notice that I have a share button. But when your teacher is using Google Classroom, you never want to use the share button. That's the whole advantage of Classroom because that adds this button here, which is the turn in button. So whenever you're doing an assignment, don't think about sharing. Think about turning it in. So let's close this and go back to Classroom. Here, when you go into a class, you've probably noticed when the class loads that you can see the assignments that your teacher created. You notice this one is marked late because I made it quite a while ago. If you click open, you can see the files that the teacher has associated with that. There are two areas here. First, instructions will show you any files that you can't type on. And those would be just things that you'll read about the assignment. You'll notice that this one does not have instructions like that. The other area is called your work. And when you click that, you'll see files that you can type on and you'll see ways to add other files. If I click on this one that the teacher shared with me, she shared it in a way that made a copy for me and everyone else in the class. And that's what I had open earlier. I could read these directions that she typed, and if I click down in this area, I can actually type anything that I need to in response to that. Again, there's a share button that I won't use, but there's a turn in button that I can click when I'm done with that assignment. Now, in some cases, you have to make a new document or a new presentation. And if that's the case, use the Create button. And you can see all of the usual types of files that you can create in Google Drive. So, for example, if I create a new document, it adds this document down here. And when I click on that, it loads. It lets me begin the document as usual. And as you can see, it does add that turn in button so that when I'm done, I can turn it in. Now you might say, what if I already typed up my document because I didn't know that. I typed it in Word or maybe I made it as a Google document, but I didn't use the create button. Well, no problem because that's what the add button is for. Here you could attach something that you already created in Google Drive. You can attach something that you created on your computer like in Word or PowerPoint. And when you upload those files, they will show up right here in this area. And then you can turn in all of the things associated with this when they're done just by clicking the Turn In button.